This is what ginger plants look like. It is a root crop with high economic value. Nigeria is Africa's largest producer of the crop and the world's second largest. However, the production of the cash crop dropped drastically in 2023 due to the outbreak of ginger blight. This development has brought about a major challenge to the social and economic well-being of ginger farmers, mostly in Kaduna State. A farmer in Zankua, Kaduna State, told me he lost ginger worth 25 million naira in 2023 to the disease. Some went to the bank, some went to individual, because they believe at the end of it they are going to do a bumper harvest. But very unfortunate, this uh, uh, disease or fungi disease came on board and he hindered uh, the, the production of uh, ginger. To this end, the Minister of Agriculture and Food Security, Awakar Kari, received the approval of the President for intervention. The National Agricultural Development Fund is therefore mandated to identify genuine farmers, train them on good agronomic practices, and encourage them to plant alternative crops. The aim is to support the smallholder farmers to plant alternative crops as their farmlands are not suitable for ginger cultivation for now. They are being supported with fertilizer, improved seeds, and chemicals. Uh, we basically concentrated on those that own the smallest uh, hectare in terms of farmlands. And we've done this in uh, three local governments uh, that covered uh, at least all the seven local governments that were affected. 5,000 farmers with 0 0.5 to 1 hectares have been supported. We'll now use this fertilizer to produce an alternative crop that will give them the opportunity to begin to secure ginger seeds whenever the disease is over. Urea that we are now receiving here is 35,000 in the market, which of course the government alleviated from this very suffering that give, they are giving us this fertilizer. I'm very grateful. Even though Nigeria ginger output this year will remain the same, the intervention by the National Agricultural Development Fund is expected to significantly increase maize and sorghum production in the country. From Kafanchan, Kaduna State,